Hey there, Paddy, and it's Kate Mar. Welcome back for another video of Life is Strange 2, guys. Oh, the game just dropped uh, some frames right there for some reason. All right, so just finished off last time talking to these two out of street uh, teenagers or uh, uh, young adults and stuff, I guess. About the same age as my character is. So I don't know. You're looking at the donation box, my guy, huh? Yeah, I know, I know. I've got a I got a gift from that, but I'm not gonna tell you. All right, so I think they're they're done uh, getting their tree and everything. Where where are they? Where's Captain Spirit at? Uh, we just gotta go back to the truck. They're ready already, man. They're already packed up, ready to go back. I can't even go on the. I I have to go on a certain hey, side, guys. guys. Ready to go? Yeah. All right, let's All go. Cool. <laughs> Hop in. Are you having too much fun back there? Yeah. That's what I thought. I mean, it's cool to be... I like these guys a lot. I like these guys a lot. It's cool to... To be with them, but... I don't know, guys. I feel like... It won't last too long. For some reason, they will move or something will happen. Like, I, I like these guys a lot. Yeah, I remember from the Captain Spirit game that our grandmother was giving them a lot of a hard time, guys, so... That's why I'm saying that, basically. Thinking that uh, maybe uh, she's gonna do something again, we're... They're gonna have to move out or something, Daniel it's gonna... Daniel a new brother. <laughs> no kidding. Make Daniel Don't sick. Like a rock. I'm glad you two came along. It's great that... Chris found a new friend out here. It looks like you did too. What's her name? Who? What are you t who? who? What are you talking about? Come on, don't play me. That cutie you were talking to by the mine. Oh. Oh, that girl. Yeah, that girl. Yeah, exactly. He said the same thing as me. Just wanted money. Oh, she just wanted money, I guess. She just. To I'm not entirely sure what she wanted to be exact. So quick. You made it hard to say yeah. she's cute, but uh, Good for to be honest, I don't even know why she talked to me. We've had a rough time over the past couple of years. My wife Emily, she died two years ago. Yeah, I'm sorry about that, dude. Obviously, uh, it was tough on Chris. Shit. Huh. I'm sorry, man. Thanks. It's been a struggle. Especially trying to be a good dad. Uh, doing your best? Having problems? I mean, you're doing your best, I guess. Doing your best. I'm gonna encourage him. I don't want to piss him off or anything. I like him a lot. And Reminds me a lot of the dad of Chloe. Before he died and everything from thanks for saying that the from uh, the things we we saw from him I guess didn't see too much He's out a of storyteller him. I see that just like Daniel you two seem to get along well I mean they're the we're both the only thing we got to each other really look out for him yeah. I realize I'm far from being up to the task Chris <laughs> deserves a real family anyway I shouldn't have brought this up okay forget it no worries it's okay buddy I mean you wanted to talk about it to somebody I'm the perfect guy to talk about it right that's how life works your grandparents sure did have their share of downs too but they're always there for us for Chris they seem like good people my mom left. Claire is hard. They are nice. No, I'll say it. I'll say it plain and simple. I won't. I won't lie. Claire is hard. All right. She, is she's fair but hard. Hard. A little bit of a control freak. I know Claire likes things to go her way, or the highway. Yeah. Sorry for bringing that up. It's okay. I hope they don't stress out because we haven't come back. Uh, yeah, we should get you two home. Uh, don't keep them waiting. Yeah. <laughs> hey, 
buddy uh, want to set up that Christmas tree? Yeah. Well, I'll get there before you with my dad mobile. <laughs> no way you can be Cappy Spirit. <laughs> See you later, Super Wolf. There, here we go, guys. They're probably Whoa. there. They're probably gonna be pissed at us oh. because we weren't there when we they came back. It's not gonna be good. I don't like this. I am not looking forward to this at all, guys. Steven? Are they even there? Looks like Grandma and Grandpa haven't come back from church yet. That's impossible. Well, at least they won't yell at us for going out. That was so cool to spend time with Chris at the market. So? Did you set things straight with him? Told him the truth? Yeah, yeah, I did. Did you know Chris's mom was an artist? I didn't. How so? She drew comics. You should see her drawings. They're so cool. Just like yours. Thanks, dude. Hey. Uh. What? What is it? Sean? I want to go check on the room. Why would you want to go there? Why is it that it's so important in mom's room that you want to go look there? Like, honestly. You won't give up. They will freak out. They will freak out. Daniel, you heard Claire. They will freak out. It's not me who doesn't want you to go there. It's Claire. And I'm not going to mess with Claire, man. You mess with her. Anything if we make it quick. It's just... I really want to know what's inside. What kind of stuff she had. She pr there's probably nothing left there. And I have nothing. Come on, Sean. You don't even have to come with me. If you don't want to. <sighs> Fuck it. I'll come with you. So you don't make a mess and get us caught. Damn it. We gotta do this. We gotta do this, I guess. I'm gonna tell you right now, Daniel. The only thing you're gonna find in that room is the past. You gotta leave your past behind, my guy. Leave your past behind and just look to the future. Stop, like, stop, uh... I just... Leave, uh, living in the past. It's not gonna help you. I swear. It doesn't seem like you wanna gently open it. Blowing a door is not gently opening it, my guy. That's why I don't want you to do it. Oh my fucking a! I can't find a do. I, I can't find a key, guys. Can't find anything. I can't go there uh, on the bottom. So it's obviously in the first floor. I can't find anything. So it's the waste of time. Big waste of time. Just open it. <sighs> we have to get into that room. Why do we have to get it? We don't have to. Uh oh! There we go. Just open it already. Oh, fuck. Can't find that stupid key. Fuck it. Just use your power and be gentle, my guy. Yes. All right. And don't. There's nobody else but me, anyways, in this house right now. So, hopefully, it's not gonna just completely crush the door open. <laughs> there you go. Really? Wow. There's not that much left. I told you. Where do you think they put the rest of her stuff? They threw it away. No, they threw it away. Claire and Steven must have thrown a lot of it away. The rest is probably packed in these boxes. Well, they gave it away. It's a difference. They probably just gave it away the way they are. A teddy bear and everything. So what are we looking for here, honestly? Hey, on, guys. There's a letter I, didn't, I haven't read that. Is that the thing I needed to do? Because I looked at everything in the room. The only thing I missed it was a letter right there. I never saw it before. Just popped out of nowhere. Why would Claire I guess that's what uh, we needed. What's this letter all about now? Is that for mom? Huh? Let me see. Daniel. All right, now let me read. God damn it, Come Daniel. On. Chill out. What is that? What's it say? Read it. 
Seriously, stop. Here, how about this? I've heard the news about Seattle. Please help my boys if they come to you. What? Why did they hide this from us? I don't know. You can reach me at, at this address. It's a P.O. box I use sometimes. What's a P.O. box? Well, a cop-out in this case. I beg you, please help my sons. Oh, yeah, right. Total bullshit. What do you mean? She cares about us. Well, I don't. Maybe she changed her mind. We could try and contact her. You don't even know her, okay? Don't get any wrong ideas. We should just stick to our plan. For now. Can I read it again? Yeah. Then we gotta go. My goodness. Oh, what happened? Oh, shit. Excuse me. What did Told you we were gonna get caught. Except visibly. Ransacking our house while we're at church. Sorry. Wanted answers. Daniel insisted. Is it, it's Daniel's fault. Oh fuck! I didn't say anything. Claire, please. Come well, I had I had timing. They went really? Way out of line here. We specifically told you to stay out of this I have room. The right. To see my mom's room. This isn't her room anymore. There is nothing to see in here. It's time you learn to respect some rules. What's your problem? Mom's letter. What what is mom's letter actually, all about actually? Did find I mean, I'm kind of interested. We found a new letter from my mom. She said she wants to see us. What? You didn't even tell us. She's not my daughter anymore or your mother. She burned all those bridges. One letter doesn't change what she did to me. All of us. She is not welcome back. Don't blame us. It's been eight years. You know what? It's been eight years. It's been you gotta get over years. it. Years. Maybe it's time to move on. Move on from the past. You dare lecture me, Sean? You don't know anything about how I feel. I can't hear that. <sighs> Listen, Sean. I know life has been tough on you the past month. Bless your souls. And, and we put up with a lot of things. Even blasphemy. But that... Breaking our door to sneak into the room. Oh, that shows you don't respect us. We could go to jail just for helping you. This is how you pay us back? Well, things are just going to change around here if you want to stay. Man, I think I see why Mom left now. She couldn't put up with your stupid rules anymore. Oh, so that's what you think. Then let me tell you something. Huh? <gasps> Steven! There we go. Having a heart attack. What the hell's going on oh, here? Oh, shit! What? Oh, my God. God damn thing. He's gonna have to use his powers. Steven, no! Knew it! Daniel's gonna have to use his powers. He's gonna freak them out. No! Stop! Or we're going to have a choice to tell him to not do it or not. Oh, I knew it. There we go. Use the power. Lift together. We're lifting together, my guy. Forget it. We're not using the power. Let's go. Claire, we got this. You'll have to pull him out. Hold on, Steven. All right. If we use the power, we're going to freak them out. I, I prefer him losing a leg over using a power and freaking them out, all right? We don't want the cops on us. Hold on. My leg. There we go. There. Come on. There we go. See? We didn't use the powers. We didn't need to do that. That was an option. Only an option. Always believe you can do it yourself without your powers. You were right, Claire. Don't be complacent. I should have fixed that cupboard months ago. I guess my laziness will get me someday. Oh, Stephen, <laughs> please don't say that. No, Claire. I, it's the sheriff. Oh, the sheriff. 
See, if he would have used this power, they would have told the cops about us and stuff. We didn't, we didn't use our powers and now we probably have a chance of surviving this. Sean, what are we gonna do? Go hide in the garage. No, no, no way. It's time for us to move. We need to find a new home, buddy. The two of you accomplices. Get your bags and go out the back door. I'll distract him. Really? Yes. No. Get the hell out of here. I know you're in here. Your car is in the driveway. <laughs> so sorry for everything. I wish we could have helped you more. I wish you could stay here with us. Thanks, Grandma. We're gonna miss you. I'll stop that. We'll yeah, see. we gotta go. As soon as we can. Okay. Thanks for helping us. Both of you. Oh, we love you. Now hurry up. Let's just go. Let's go, Daniel. No time to mourn or no time to do anything, alright? We gotta go. Pack our things and go real quick. Great job distracting the cop. At least there's that. Move your ass, bro. You got this, Daniel. Oh, there's more cops. Good lord, they're bringing back up. This way. And they're ready for us. We gotta leave Captain Spirit behind. Uh, oh, or maybe we could just go through his house. Oh god. Uh, Shit, that's a lot of cops. We gotta go. They saw us. What are we doing peeking in? Oh my god. Use your power. Use your power. Daniel. What? What are you doing, Daniel? Fuck. Well, Chris is fucked. My god. See, this is what happens. He made Chris think that he had powers and all of a sudden, Chris thinks, tries to save us with powers because he thinks he's got some. What happens? He dies. I told you, Daniel. I told you it would happen to this. Why did Chris jump Never listens. Car, Never listens to his, fr his brother, doesn't he? He's okay, Yanano. The car barely touched him. I don't, f I don't, not thinking so sure about that. I'm pretty sure he's gonna die or something. You asked me to. Christ's sake. I, I'm sorry. Couldn't Sean. you just do anything to stop I'm him? You want to use you your powers all the time, but all of a sudden you see Chris getting run over by a car, and you want, you don't want to use uh, your power. But, like honestly, dude. Worry. The importance of using your powers in the right times. He doesn't know about that, he doesn't he? Dead. He's fine. Well, we don't know about that for sure, but uh know that, okay. I'm I'm pretty sure myself. Stop jumping into conclusions. We'll catch up on him as soon as we can. I I but but I need to know. You will. Just later. When it's safe. Sean. I'm tired of running away. Why does my power always bring trouble? You don't have to use your power. If you don't want to. But. I'm good with it. And I'm the only one who can do these things. I know, but. Daniel, you need to be careful and listen to your brother. You think we'll see Grandma and Grandpa again? I doubt it. I don't know. Yeah, I really doubt it. We'll see. Where are we gonna go now? 
see. I've got no idea. See we got our mom, P.O. address and everything. We got the letter, I Don't believe. Her, okay. But, but uh, for some reason, plan? Sean doesn't want to go there. Stick to the plan. We go to Puerto Lobos. That's where we belong. No one will tell us what to do. We can be whoever we want. Y you think? I don't know. Trust me, man. From now on, we make our own rules. Look, I wanted to wait until then, but we kind of need a little cheer, so. Merry Christmas, Inanna. For me? Thanks, Sean. Hey. Listen. There's a ride. Come on. All aboard. All right, we're going to doing some pit stops, huh? Oh, with a train. Okay, well, I didn't even realize we were on the train rack. You better, you better go quick if you want to catch the train, Dan. You ready for this, Daniel? Ready to jump and quick? I don't know how we're gonna do this, to be honest. Oh, there we go. Daniel's in, I'm in. All right, we're good. This buzz there must be some music right now playing, but there's none for us. Okay. There it goes. We're catching up the train. Moving on to Mexico for some reason. I don't even know. How does he know where to go to go to Mexico, to be honest? That's what I'm figuring. I'm trying to figure out here. He's not on the south border. So I don't know. To be continued. Oh, well. Here we go, guys. That's the end, I guess. Finished off with going off track. Nearly. So, episode 2 rules. Very interesting um, episode, to say the least. Very interesting episode, yes. Uh, toggle to speed up. I'm going to just speed it up. Um, I really like that episode a lot. I, I just like the first one. A lot of story. A lot of... The game itself is really awesome. The way it works, the way it plays, feels. I like Daniel's powers a lot. They actually make sense for the story itself. Um, I like the fact that you, you can choose between having responsibility or not for it. You're basically the one controlling the one behind that has the powers. So you're the one who has the responsibility of looking after a, a child that has powers. You got to make choices and you can only make great choices if you already had a, a, if you already know how to deal with that in real life, you know, uh, Earl, I've got a, of course you guys. You are older fans or older viewers, I, I would prefer to call it. You already know I have a sister and everything, so I know how to deal with a younger sister. I know how to deal with that. So I know how to deal with Daniel. But for people, most of other YouTubers probably, they would say, oh, go ahead, use your powers or go ahead, do this and that because they don't know how to react. You know, they don't, how, they don't know how to control younger brother or younger sister they don't know what it's like uh, usually most uh, mo nowadays millennial millennials their parents uh, they, it's usually uh, they don't they don't usually have the right parents or anything they usually have uh, mono parents or and stuff like that well, I don't and I have a, a normal life so I know how it is really how it works and everything and I know how to control people. So uh, let's look at our decisions really quick. Uh, so I'm part of my majority with true snow pala, Daniel. All right. <laughs> so I guess I missed my shot completely. Uh, you part of my majority who intervened and scared the cougar off, of course. So, okay. People didn't let him kill the cougar, of course, Peda and everything. People don't want uh, an animal to get hurt. That's only normal. I'm pretty sure that's the reason. Um, no one prayed. I'm part of a minority. Oh, 
the majority of people, the big time majority of people actually prayed with Claire and Daniel, really. That's interesting. Huh, that's very interesting. So people, well, I guess, I guess since I'm, I'm from, I'm, I'm living uh, in Quebec, so over here, no religion and stuff. So I guess it makes a difference compared to the United States or something. I don't know, guys. Uh, you pretended you didn't know anything. 54%. Uh, so I'm part of the majority. Okay. I'm part of the majority for, for most of them. That's pretty interesting. That's most, mostly different from other games. Other games usually, you, you already know Telltale Games and Life is Strange games. That's uh, usually not the case. So what am I in majority, minority of? Not too much, huh? Yeah, I guess. Oh, minority right there. You told Daniel to stop lying to Chris about his power. So, wait. The majority of people wanted P wanted Daniel to, to keep lying. But that wouldn't have changed the situation anyways. I told him to stop lying. And Daniel still... Tr uh, Chris still tried to save us and got him killed. Pretty sure. That would have been even worse if he... Like, what is the pe what are people thinking, really, honestly? Do they want people to die in their games, or how does it go? I don't know, guys. Um, majority, oh, minority, right there. You stole a Christmas present for Daniel. Okay, so I'm, uh, how do you, why did, why would people buy? First off, you've got $9, I've got, had $9 left on my pockets. How do you want me to pay, like, 6 or $7? And get uh, just have two dollars left on my pockets just for a goddamn Christmas gift when you could buy at least some food or some supplies for got that money left that you got. That's ridiculous. People don't think about money or something. Come on now. Uh, you chose to pull Stefan out together and injure his leg, so part the majority of people started to fr may decided to freak out their parents. Basically, use their powers. I, yeah, I knew it, guys. I knew it. See, see what I was talking about? Majority of people don't have sisters, don't have brothers, or basically don't know how to deal with real stuff like this. They, they just don't know how to deal properly with situations like this. They just act uh, impulsively with emotions, which you shouldn't do. You should never do that. Uh, okay, majority. Minority continued to swear. So Daniel continued to swear. Well... I couldn't do it too much about that. Dice games. Okay, so. Daniel was repressed from using his powers. There we go. So, to, uh, see, majority of people actually rep are repressing him from using his powers. Even though majority of tell, uh, did tell him to use his powers to save uh, our grandparent. Which is kind of weird. 99 89%, you would think that would bring that up. Anyways, guys. Was too upset to enjoy his presence. Oh, so he did not enjoy it. I thought he enjoyed it. I, I don't know. Anyways, remember to leave. I'm going to stop it right there, guys. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you did enjoy the video. I'm going to see you guys for the next one. Keep it easy. So, this is it? Yeah. It looks like a nettle field. And it stinks. <laughs> yeah. Your stinky feet will cover the smell. Shut up. They don't. Come on. <laughs> I'll show you around. <laughs>